How's it going? I'm Beatnik. Uh, today I'm going to do my first unboxing video. Uh, I've been a subscriber of the Indie Box, which for those that don't know, it's a company that monthly will ship out a game, an indie game, but it's like a collector's version. They got all sorts of cool stuff in there, like some paper craft and the soundtrack and as well as a copy of the game. And I've just been loving it so far and thought I would share the latest one that's just come in today. So, this month, awesome little message saying thank you. Very much appreciated. Let's dive in. So, seriously, I've been loving this every month. There's been something more awesome. Ah ha ha. Lovely planet. How cool does that look? <laughs> wow. All right. Dive in. Yeah, I gotta watch out. I've got a product code sitting there. Let me make sure that's not given away by accident. So yeah, that's another thing that's really cool that they do each month. They are they give you on the outside they'll give you the product code so that you can redeem on Steam. So if you're someone who wants to keep these in mint condition, um, because they are all collector's editions, uh, they actually make it so you can enjoy the game without ever opening the box, but I, I think you'd be missing out on so much. There is so much cool things, so many cool things in these boxes, and they're always different every week. <laughs> like chopsticks. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> and it's even the, um, that's what the characters are within the game. Some of the enemies. Oh, that is cool. What's next? <laughs> So we got the little guys. Once again, all characters within the game. There's a little <laughs> stress square. I've never seen a stress cube before. That's definitely something different. Another stress cube. So they can match. They can be stressed together. Though one is very so angry. And he's so worried about how angry the other guy is. Oh, we got a nice inflatable beach ball. How else if I do it on screen? Anyway. Awesome. Lovely planet inflatable ball. I'll try inflating that in a second. That's going to make for riveting video. So, the other thing they do is they... They actually give you an instruction manual. When so many of these games are all digital, it's like you never get to see all the uh, instruction manuals with all the art and all the work that goes into them. And like letters from the developer and everything. It's just, it's just a nice touch to give you an old school feel for all of these, even though everything is all digital at them now. So yes. All the achievements and everything listed in here. That is going to be... I'm looking forward to jumping into this as well. Then you also got... The original soundtrack. I love the feel they've got for with all of this. Ah, oh, they're all so lovely. Look, every song is lovely. I wonder if I could play them on here. So... And now, this is how they deliver the game each month. So, this is a USB. It's a card, but it's a USB. And they do it every month. So you can install it DRM free, which is another cool thing. So you can use the Steam voucher if you like, but the other way is you can just install it via USB. That's it. This thing is a USB. It's so cool. Otherwise, it's just a nice little thing to have for display. Just put that back in it. Little cushiony box there. Now we're running out of room. This desk is tiny. And the scope of this camera is just as tiny. And the other thing every month is stickers. At the moment, <laughs> with an indie box theme for each month. As well as one for the actual game. So... 
I am looking forward to just decorating. I'm de decorating my laptop with all of these at the moment, and it's... I'm just liking seeing it slowly fill up with all of these stickers, which are looking awesome. And then, yeah, there's also a uh, newsletter each month for what's happening with the IndieBox team, as well as a bit about the uh, devs of the game and everything that's happening. But, seriously, I'm just loving this every month. There's just something so interesting with everything that they've done. There's something unique in all of it, whether it's stress cubes. Uh, I had some paper craft from last month, which was good fun to put together. That's the spaceship from Next Penelope. And yeah, it's just something interesting each month. So anyway, I'm, I'm just loving the indie box. So I'm going to just do the unboxing every month for the hell of it, just to share something I'm enjoying and uh, hope you enjoy. Let me know what you think in the comments and uh, I'll put a link to the indie box as well so you can check it out if you're interested. I'll catch you next time. Yeah.